All right, the rig <laughs> you're making me nervous, all right? Uh, the regular season finale calls for a special snack for your watch party, which means that you have to bring the recipe to the ult you have to bring you got to bring the ultimate appetizer and there's nothing more than the ulti ultimate appetizer that we're talking about pretzels here. Yep. And we have Best Regards Bakery. Mr. Uh, Robert Dunsing yep. is with us here and you're going to make some pretzels for us. Yeah, I'm going to show you how to do this. There's um, the recipe up on the website so it'll help everybody. So I'm gonna take. I'm gonna be showing you the demo halfway through the process. Okay. But if you're gonna do this at home, the pro level is make your own bread, whatever recipe you have to do. Okay. If you know how to do it, great. If you don't, don't worry. Today's not the time to learn. Okay. If you have a bread, <laughs> if you have a bread machine, use that. Okay. After you do the first rise, take the dough out, divide it, follow instructions on the recipe. Okay. Then the easiest way is using frozen dinner rolls from the grocery store. Okay. Anybody can do this. Yeah. Okay. All right? So what you're gonna do. You're going to have the dough, the dough balls from the frozen dinner rolls. Okay. Put them in a pan, lightly spray them, let it thaw in the refrigerator, cover it overnight. Okay. You're going to bring it out in the morning. Mm -hmm. So about about an hour before the, the your pre party, you're going to have the table cleaned. You're going to kind of shape it roughly like this. Okay. You're going to shape them all like that. When you're done, they're going to look like this. Shazam, right. look at so, that. So, that's what, so and it only takes about 30 minutes for it to rise. Okay. So this is baking soda and boiling water. You don't have to mess with lye, other things, you're just going to have this. Okay. So you have the boiling water, then you're going to take these and you're going to put these in here for about, these are small, so about 30 seconds. If you want to make it a little bit bigger, you can use, uh, you can put two pieces of bread together. Okay. So you're going to have this in the boiling water. You're just going to let it set for about 20 seconds, flip it over so both sides gets done. And so that's this is what gives pretzel bread that nice brown color. Okay. And a little bit harder texture yeah. to it. Yep, yep. So yep. that's all there is to doing this. Once it's done from here, you put it back on a pan and you could put it directly into the oven, 350 to 400 degrees, bake it for about 10, 15 minutes. And you have fresh made pretzel bread that you made. That's it? That's it. That's all there is to it. Now, when it comes out of the oven, what you can do is. You can take, um, but I use Irish butter. Mm -hmm. That's the best that there is. Right. <laughs> Lightly brush it with melted butter. Okay. Just put a little bit of a coarse sea salt mm -hmm. on there if you want to. I like using this. This is the everything, you know, the everything um, on bagel topping. You sprinkle on it and you kind of see what it looks like. Oh, okay. What's it got? What is? What's it have in here? Well, there's sesame seeds. There's um, toasted sesame seeds, coarse sea salt. Um, I'm not sure what else is in there. There's probably I, I should look at it. Right? It tastes good. Right? I like using beer cheese soup as a, a which is almost like a fondue. Um, we use uh, at the bakery. We make an 80 acre beer cheese soup. We also honey mustard's a great thing to dip with it. Um, you can have um, fresh made mustard or coarse mustard that you like, some German style. But it's a great appetizer for a watch party because you bake it up fresh. It's not really much work, and it tastes absolutely fantastic. Are those edible? We... Uh, absolutely. Yeah. Just baked those um, about an hour ago. Oh, you did. Yeah. Well, let's get let's see here. Let's so give here it a try here. I'm gonna just. Soup. I'm going to use my, uh, going to use my fingers oh, yeah. here. Look who's crashing oh. the oh, hello. <laughs> hello. <laughs> hello. <laughs> hello. <laughs> Come on. Get one. This oh, is man. That's amazing. Isn't good that good? Mmm. And so you see how easy it is that you can make this at home. Yeah. And it tastes fresh. You can do all that kind of stuff. If you, if you don't want to do, go to that much trouble, we sell it at the bakery on game days, or the day on Saturday of game weekend. Okay. Come in and buy those and just put them in the oven for, oh, maybe about five, 10 minutes to warm it up so it feels like it tastes. <laughs> <laughs> you guys tell us, where are you, where are you at? Where's your store? We're in Overland Park, Kansas, Best Regards Bakery at 119th and Glenwood. 119th yep. and Glenwood. And you go to the website at makethemsmile.com, you'll see pictures of everything that we do. Oh, the, the sugar the cookies. cookies. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Uh, this, this is not a double dip, all right? Okay, it's a fresh beast going in it here. Looks oh my gosh. Kinda, it looks double oh, no. dip ish. Oh. oh, no, he's got <laughs> confirmation. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's the beauty of pretzels. You tear them up, you mm -hmm. dip, you know, you try the beer cheese soup, then mm -hmm. you can try the honey mustard that's over there in the front. Holy cow. Let me try that. Isn't that good? So good. All right, Robert, great to see you, man. Thank you. Go, go Chiefs. All right, when we come back, go pretzels. We're going to get the gang's <laughs> predictions on tomorrow's big game, and we're going to see who, who came on top last week, who, who won last week. We'll find all that out. I was off. Lucky for you guys, I've won like the last three. <laughs> Whatever.